175 river miles conquered in four days by paddlers from all over the world. My name is Mickey and this is my experience of the Larutamaya Belize River Challenge. Hello everyone, this is Mickey. Welcome to my channel where we learn lessons from life experience and when I get a chance I show you something in the place or the country where I am working. In today's video I am going to show you my experience of the Larutamaya Belize River Challenge. The 175 mile canoe race was conceptualized by a man called Richard Harrison of Big H Enterprises. And it was done for the sole purpose of launching a brand new purified water. And the first race was held on the 9th of March 1998. With time, this challenging canoe race covered in four days has become the longest race in Central America, bringing into Belize professional and amateur paddlers from all over the world. Day one of the race starts from San Ignacio in the west of Belize to banana bank and then in day two it goes from banana bank to double head cabbage and then from double head cabbage to barrel boom in day three and then for the grand finale it goes from barrel boom into belize city where the paddlers and the canoes will be greeted by a lot of crowd and a party that awaits them since I couldn't get the courage to participate in this nice occasion, I am going to tag along with three of my co-workers and I'll be asking them their experience of the competition. And I will also be showing you some of the parties that goes along the route of this nice occasion. So I'll say come with me and enjoy. We start with a trip to San Ignacio, set up camp and then go into the market to get our food for the duration of the competition. And then in the evening, we hit the town. Like every Belize occasion, it starts with some music, booze, and some dancing. well we're feeling confident that we're gonna do something good today you know it is it's a nice little challenge so we try to make the best out of it hopefully we do something good <laughs> looking ready for this big race yeah. <laughs> it's my first time so let's see what I got up let's see what I can do for the I.O. but so <laughs> Alex, 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 Alex,
What's up? Yeah, good. How are you feeling? I'm feeling kind of nervous and anxious, you know, it's my first time, so it's a new experience for me. I'm hoping for the best, you know, finish the race and putting my mind to it, you know. Although a lot of guys say about the crack and stuff, you know, I'm ignoring that part, you know, and hoping for the best and just doing it for the Belizean people, you know. Good.
experience. So my first day, you know, I it's really tougher than what I expected, man. It's like pain, you know, muscle pain and your back's hurting, you know. So the, the journey we did was seven hours and 20 minutes, you know. And being the first time, the, guy, the other guys said, well, we did good, you know. But yeah. when you hit the time, like midday, you know, that's when your muscles start giving up, you know, like. You, you can't go no more man but you you need to finish because you're gonna stay nowhere right so you know a, i'm intrigued sorry to cut you but i'm intrigued to know when the first horn went and everyone was going for it how did your body feel how did you feel well it was kind of nervous because on my mind was don't capsize don't capsize you know and we managed not doing it. We did the whole race without capsizing, you know. We had some some rapids that, man, those stuff are really dangerous, you know. It kind of makes you get kind of shaky because you you don't want to capsize. But we managed to do it, and it was good, you know. Long journey, painful, but we end up doing it good, and we managed. I I want you to be honest with me. Are you looking forward to tomorrow? Man, I I am, you know, because I. I'm done for it, and I need to finish the race, you know, and I, I cannot quit. All right. Thank you very this much. This is your third one? Third yeah. Time. So how was today compared to the other two you've done? Yeah, the two I've done, it's, it's been kind of rough. Eventually, yeah, um, the river has been shallow a lot of places compared to, other, to the last two years that I've done. It's been very hectic. The corners are very rough. The rapids are kind of rough. We've been swing, swinging from left to right, you know. But eventually, we we made it. What about the rain? The rain. Well, it the was rain, very the heavy. Rain, the rain was very heavy. It was great though because I mean there wasn't the sun wasn't so hot, and the rain kept us kind of a cool and fresh. So it gave us more time to pull and paddle a little bit more. So, you know, we weren't that burned out due to, due to we kept cool all the way. Usually when, when it's extra hot, man, you got to keep drinking a lot of water, keep hydrated or else you start to see stars, you know, but besides that, it went, it went good, it went good. Are you looking forward to tomorrow? Well, definitely we're ready. Though we are in a little bit of pain, but we are more likely we a good rest tonight. Then we're supposed to be... Um, Ready to go tomorrow morning. Okay. Well done. Uh, thank you. How was today? Your first experience? Uh, <laughs> well, at first I was taking it a little bit light. But after I have finished it today, it, it's, it's a beast. <laughs> it's not easy. I mean, man, the long distance and it tells on your, 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 your butt, your back, especially your hands. My hand keep, kept cramping up and everything. But I managed to get through. And with the help of the, you know, we didn't have much sun today. It was a big um, advantage for us. Because if we had that sun, I think we'd have come in much later. But it was, it was okay. The horn went for oh, the start. I was feeling a little bit nervous, anxious, you know. <laughs> Wanted to see, see, you know. But after seeing a lot of pilots flipping over at the start, and we kept our distance and took our time getting through the the rapids and stuff that was at the start with all the pilots battling it made a lot of rapids but I was a little bit you know because it's my first time but after a while you know we got through it so are you good. looking forward to tomorrow yeah I'm looking forward to my bed also right now yeah all right okay I won't hold you for long well done yes, for AJ. Today. <laughs> right. hello guys so this is the conclusion of Laritamaya 2020 day one um, I was so keen to get the end bit for you, the finishing of today's leg, but I couldn't because our vehicle bogged down and we were trying to get help, but we managed to pull ourselves out of that situation. So we are in our camp. If you see, this will be my residence for tonight. It's not bad. I'll show you about and you'll see where we will be sleeping. We'll be sleeping in tents behind me. Tomorrow, I will bring you leg two of 2020 Laritamaya. And I hope you enjoyed the first leg. Um, the guys have done really well. I think they did 40 miles, 40 miles. Tomorrow will be 60 miles. So yeah, we we'll look forward to that. And there was a, a lot of rain today as well. 
So the fun was a bit funnier for me. I'm sure maybe not for some of the guys. Some of them look a bit grumpy, but hey, I'm sure they had fun. So yeah, see you tomorrow.